Radio. And now, Ham Radio Concepts presents another exciting amateur radio video, keeping ham radio operators informed with a thorough look at the new products. Now, here's your host, Eric, KJ4YZI. What's up, everyone? Eric with Ham Radio Concepts, bringing you the latest news courtesy of ICOM Japan website, releasing moments ago the debut of the ID4100 Alpha or Export Radio, a brand new D-Star radio, mobile, that is comparable with a lot of features that you're familiar with, specifically to the ID51 Plus 2. I think this is going to be the mobile version, pretty much, of the ID51 Plus 2. You'll see on here, compact, full dot matrix D-Star mobile with terminal and access point mode. Now, this is a very short video. I don't have this in my hand. Nobody does. It is being released sometime in the next month or two. Date is truly unknown. But... Uh, giving you a fast overview in under five minutes on what this radio has to offer. Looking down here, the dual band VHF UHF 50 watt mobile. And what I want to touch on, not only with the detachable face and the full DTMF keypad and D-Star and analog modes, but the terminal and access point mode. If you're not familiar with those, those are available in the ID51 Plus 2. Terminal and access point mode it says right here, extend D-Star coverage with the internet. So what does this mean? The terminal mode, you can set this radio up with the, you see the little one here, the optional data cable and download is free. So, or the optional data cable and free download. So, the download is free for the software and the cable is probably an additional purchase. Not sure about the price on the cable. Now, you can set this up with the PC or Android device through the internet and sit at your radio and talk through the global D-Star network, similar to what System Fusion does with a node as they call it with the HRI 200 but instead of buying additional things like that set the radio up use it on your shack talk into it and it goes through the global D-Star network out to a repeater somewhere else anywhere in the world access point mode again with the little one here with the additional cable allows you to set this radio up with a PC or Android device on data and use this as a hotspot so now that might eliminate the need of taking a DV mega hotspot with you or a Shark RF or anything. And you can use this with another radio like an ID51 and talk into it and it would relay the data, data or voice transmission through the internet. So you can set this up at HamFest with a laptop that's on data um, or even in a mobile environment at different events. And use this with your local club members or friends with D-Star radios and use this as a hotspot. That's awesome. And those features are new with the ID51 Plus 2, and now they're in the ID4100 that was just announced. Um, another cool feature, Bluetooth hands-free operation requiring an optional Bluetooth unit and headset will allow you to use this in a mobile environment, keying and talking on the radio wirelessly, hands-free. Great for the guy that's mobile or gal that's mobile in a, in a mobile environment and doesn't want to mess with the radio. Set it and go driving with the headset. Uh, integrated GPS and micro SD card is also available, which is probably, um, you know, all the features that are in here for D star functionality are going to be available similar to the ID 51 and the ID 50, uh, ID 5100 and ID 51, as far as GPS, the DR function and such enhanced remote control apps for smart devices. So you can use this with the app that they're probably going to update to allow this to communicate with the app on Bluetooth wirelessly to send pictures to map out repeaters and set the radio to the certain frequency of the repeater that you're wanting to access so the app is going to be uh, usable with this also and you do have to have the optional bluetooth uh, interface for that so the id 51 i'm sorry id 4100 alpha 50 watt and no sooner that i got this message from a post online that i saw gigaparts is already taking reservations for this 35 bucks for a reservation and they have some features on here, which I pretty much discussed, but you can set your reservation. The price is unknown at this time, and anything I have said is unconfirmed, unofficial. Things will change. When they announce these things, things will change. So if there's a feature that has been changed since the time you watched this video, don't hold it against me. Other than that, I hope this video in under five minutes brought you an announcement of something you didn't know about. If you learned about it, click the thumbs up, share this. Get this going on Facebook, announce it to your friends, post all over, and you saw it here first on Ham Radio Concepts on YouTube. 7-3 from KJ4YZI.